go, go back to a second where we were talking about exercise because now the let's say the listener is sold on this and they think you know what i i i really need this i need all the benefits that this comes with um they look at someone like seth and they're thinking okay you're in a good routine right now and a good rhythm and good motivation and you're going out there and getting exercise regularly talk to the person that's struggling to 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 get there or struggling to get get the motor going and get into that routine how can someone get into that exercise uh, kind of rhythm and, and, and get started and, you know, uh, talk to that person. Yes. So there's a number of things. It kind of depends on where you're at right now. A lot of times what it takes is to lose a little bit of weight and you can do that without even going to the gym. So if it's really hard to, to get cardio going or it's, you just feel so sluggish, you have extra weight, try changing the diet first. Try swapping out heavy foods for breakfast and increasing the fruits and seeing if the weight does, doesn't go away. If you have more energy naturally, you might find that, oh my God, I actually feel like getting active today. What am I going to do with all this energy? I just interviewed um, Grant Campbell, who I met at Woodstock this past year as well. And he said he got into ultra marathon, long distance running, like hundred mile races because he had so much energy after going into raw veganism that he just started running, you <laughs> wow. know? So, so step one, take a stock at how is your body? Can you stand to lose some weight? Well, you can do that naturally without even working too hard at the gym, just by stopping eating the foods that are so hard and slow to digest that they end up backing up and causing you to gain fat. So that's one thing. Um, the other is I just watch a lot of YouTube of like cool, inspiring, stuff and people i really like cali move like calisthenics is cali move it's two it's two german guys and i just i learned a lot from them i just kind of watch them to see how the how the form is done for proper pups proper squats and this I would is say stuff just, you, you can do for this is stuff you can do from home yeah yeah just get on youtube or instagram cali move i mean that's just one one group of dudes who do calisthenics there's so many of them but I think they're, they're Germans and German culture is really into like precision and engineering. And like, so you'll see in these videos, they're very well done. Their form is impeccable. And so I think for the person who's struggling to get started, I would just start doing very, very basic stuff. Like don't even make it hard. Um, find a, a body weight squat form and just try to do perfect form, you know, squats up and down. Don't even add weight because if your form's not there, you're probably going to end up hurting yourself or not doing it right, you know, and causing an imbalance. So yeah, what? Oh. And then the third thing I would say yeah. is just know your why. Like, okay, why do you wanna be active? Just constantly remind yourself of that. Well, I wanna feel good, I wanna look good. Great, get at it. <laughs> like, what are you waiting for, you know? Um, but I do think it's a mistake. It's a very common understanding amongst people in this culture that you have to go to the gym to lose weight. And that's not true. Ask anyone who was overweight that switched out their animal products for fruit. The, the weight just starts shedding off. Yes. So, mm -hmm. um, and maybe that might be the, the boost you need just to start getting out there and start going for walks. But I would focus on like form, like walk before you can run, you know, body weight before you add any weights. Um, oh, but the most important thing I think is to have fun. So what is a physical activity that you enjoy already? I love skateboarding and I love biking. Okay, cool. I'm just going to do more of that. Too. Yeah. I'm not going to force myself to run if I don't like running, right? I'd much rather get on that bike and zoom through traffic and like get on these trails. And it's so fun to me. So find something that you enjoy. Do you enjoy rebounding on a trampoline? Get after it. Do you enjoy dancing? Just dance. Who needs to go to a gym? Why slog away? at a gym, if you're like, I don't want to do this, if you can just be dancing in your apartment, having a blast, if you love doing that, you're going to get some cardio, you're going to end up actually stretching and using your muscles in like, um, practical ways. Yes, you'll, so, move, you'll move your lymph. Yeah. Dancing. Yeah. So find things that, that are fun, find things mm -hmm. that are fun, know your why, check the diet. And I forget, there was one other thing I said, but yeah, those are the main things I think. Wow. Um, we're talking with Seth Balin. Um, 
make sure to check out our other segments with Seth where we go into um, some tips and tricks on getting the best quality fruit with the fruit companion guide and also where we're going to talk about the principles of natural hygiene, understanding the the mechanics of how the body actually heals and solves itself. Um, Seth is a very, he's a humble guy. He said, he's, he says that, um, you know, he doesn't know everything, but he, Seth is a great example of somebody who has transformed their life. Um, so we, we really appreciate you being with us, Seth. Um, as we close here, 